My name is Lily Wong Kissel. I'm a pediatric epileptologist at the Mayo Clinic in Rochester, Minnesota. I will talk about comorbidities of childhood epilepsy. Comorbidities are medical conditions which frequently occur together in patients with the same disorder. The comorbidities of childhood epilepsy include attention deficit hyperactivity disorder, ADHD, learning disability, sleep difficulties, depression, anxiety, and migraine headaches. These are not necessarily symptoms caused by epilepsy, but rather the underlying cause of epilepsy can also manifest in these additional symptoms. This is why even when seizures are well controlled, these problems may continue. This is why in certain children, these symptoms may persist or manifest even before first seizures begin. So let's talk a little bit more about Attention Deficit Hyperactivity Disorder, or ADHD. Children with epilepsy are five to 10 times more likely to have ADHD than those without epilepsy. The diagnosis of ADHD begins with a questionnaire that are filled out by parents and teachers. Treatment of ADHD may include behavioral therapy, medications, including stimulants and non-stimulants. Stimulant medications are not triggers of uh, seizures. They do not typically trigger seizures. Epilepsy does not exclude the use of stimulants in children with epilepsy with ADHD. Your physician should use the medication that is most effective with the least side effect to treat these symptoms. In terms of mood disorder, about one in 10 children may have symptoms with depression. One in five or four children may have symptoms of anxiety. It is important to observe for these symptoms in your children because certain seizure medications may help with these symptoms while others worsen them. In terms of headaches, headaches can be frequently seen in children with epilepsy. Headaches can also occur around the time of seizures. Children who have headaches can get acute treatment using ibuprofen, acetaminophen, around the time of ongoing headaches. If headaches are frequent, there are certain seizure medications that can be used as preventative treatment for headaches. These seizure medication may include topiramate, also known as topamax, valproic acid, also known as Depakote. Sleep is also important. Sleep may mimic symptoms of other comorbidities. Poor sleep or lack of sleep can cause irritability, mimicking depression, anxiety. Poor sleep can cause focusing more difficult, and some children may appear more hyperactive. Sleep difficulties, such as restless leg symptom or sleep disorder breathing, needs to be treated because poor sleep can cause poor seizure control. So in summary, although the goal of seizure control and tre seizure treatment is uh, being on medication without any seizures, it is also important to recognize the comorbidities of epilepsy because effective intervention can be available.